Hello everybody, I'm Sharp and Blade, and today we have an unboxing from White Mountain Knives, and I don't remember what this is. <laughs> so to open this up, I'm going to use my brand spanking new Lumi, and uh, yeah, just tear into it. And see what it is. I ordered. I'm opening this up upside down because there's a lot of information on the other side. So just... Oh my word, okay, just a... <laughs> Okay, so that oh yeah yeah yeah. Okay. Try not to get banking peanuts everywhere. It is titanium scales, titanium elementum scales. So where did my elementum go? Oh, here it is. So I'm going to put these on and see how they feel. I might as well do that now, I guess. Why not? Um, let's see here. I've been carrying the elementum for a little bit now. Um, I was kind of hoping these were contoured a bit, but they're still flat. But they do have a little bit more contouring here. So, uh, yeah, okay. We will see how this looks. So, all right, let's get started. Okay, now I have a disassembly mat, but it's a very bright color and I don't think it'll look very good on the screen. <laughs> so, let's start. Here, we'll loosen this up a little bit. Okay. And actually, you know what? We'll open this up too. There. That's better. We are. Uh, which one's a good one? It's one of these bits that's kind of rounded a bit. Or is this T8 all the way around? Oh, that's T8 all around. That's awesome. Okay. Duh. Well, I could just use the same. <laughs> just use this. <laughs> um, so I've been carrying this this for a couple of days now and um, I don't know if I found the scales kind of flat I would wish they could you know a little bit more thickness would feel a little bit more comfortable in hand it feels good in hand but I'd like it to feel a little bit better in hand I guess I'll just take them right out I hope I don't run into any Loctite anywhere but I don't think I will this out oh jeez so nervous taking something apart on camera <laughs> there we go it's y'all went flying all right Now I'm going to, I was going to take this apart and clean everything up a little bit because I thought there might be some, something going on in the action here, but everything looks fairly clean. So I think it's just, the action just needs to be broken in a little bit better. Oopsie, there goes the, oopsie poopsie.
caught in there with the pocket clip or what? Yeah. Okay, okay. okay that's T6. All right. Is this T6 or is this T8? Let's put the T8 back in. My gracious. that out. Alright, alright. What's that sound? It sounds like just a little bit of... Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Alright, alright, alright. Another one here. Oh my gracious, huh? <laughs> here it'll be easier I'm probably doing this incredibly incorrect at least it's on camera I'm not even looking at the at, at my phone okay that worked I like how it looks, at least. Get in there. Get in there. Yeah, gotta look at this a little bit closer. There we go. clip. Try not to lose any of these screws because they are a pain in the butt to get in there. All right. Now this goes in here. How did that one go? Get to stop in. I don't think it is the right way or the wrong way. We'll find out though. That is, that would have bothered me. <laughs> oh no. Okay. Maybe it'll spin around if I can do, put it in and then spin it around here. No, that's not going to work. Okay. That's going to bother me to no end. Let's get this back apart again. All right. Take this right off here. It's got to be perfect because that will bother me. Thinking that's pretty stinking good. If not, then I apologize. Come on, buddy. Get in there. This is going to be a long, un well, it's not that long, I guess. I was going to say it's going to be a long unboxing, but it's not too, 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 too bad. All right, so let's just put this in here to hold this in place for now. So I think these scales, I'm not going to tighten that up. I think these scales are relatively, I'll look at this off here. I think these scales are relatively new. 
offering from um, Flytanium, I think. They had just popped up on White Mountain Knives not too long ago. So yeah, like I was saying, I found the micarta scales on this, and I suppose any stock scales would be pretty much the same. They'd be pretty, pretty flat. Um, now is everything lined up already? I didn't find them to be that comfortable. You know, they are, there's not much to them, right? But this, uh, that needs to be loosened up a smidgey ridgey. Alright. It was off center too, a little bit at the time. That's very, very, very. Alright, did I do something wrong here? This is extremely <laughs> off center now. Oh no. There we go. I said it really come on to it, tighten it up more. There we are. Now, it's centered up. Wow, it actually centered itself up? Good. All right, you centered itself up? Good. <laughs> but it's, uh, yeah, still a little, well, it kind of failed on me a couple times too, so I think that's pretty good. Actually, I don't want to play with it, mess around with it too much because I like the centering. Like I say, it was off center before, but now it appears to be centered. So let's see how it feels in hand. Now, it doesn't fill up the hand that much better. I should have looked at this before. It is a little bit thicker, though. It's a little bit thicker than the, than the stock scales. Slightly thicker. Not a lot thicker, but slightly thicker. But it is milled, like right here and up here. So it is more comfortable in hand. That's really nice. That made it, like, it feels like a different knife. That is impressive. Okay. And these are really nice scales, too. And it looks good. I like that. The black hardware. That is really sharp looking. Yeah, the action is about the same as before. So yeah, well that went very well. <laughs> I'm shocked at how easy that was. <laughs> but uh, yeah, very impressed. Um, I'll leave a link to uh, Flytanium and to White Mountain Knives to these scales. I think there's still some of these scales left in stock. Maybe not on White Mountain Knives, but there'll be a link to Flytanium anyways. So if they're not on White, on White Mountain Knives, you can get them from Flytanium themselves. So, uh, thanks so much for watching. Where's that sticker? Oh, yeah, here we go. Thanks so much for watching. Take care.